Hello friends, welcome to our channel Treknosh. Imagine a journey, a walk through through a lush green dense jungle in the perfect weather where the sun rays were slipping between the trees to reach you. What if this journey then leads to an astonishing waterfall which you can have all to yourself? Does it sound unreal? No, it's true. One such gem is Kathalda Waterfall. So guys, in this video, we are going to see how to reach Kathaldar waterfall and experience the trek. As per my experience, a lot of people struggle to find the starting point of Kathaldar waterfall and it's quite a bit challenging task. The only indication is the two identical mango trees on the left hand side, which are just 100 meters before the Kuhn waterfalls on the same trek route which further goes towards the famous Rajamachi Fort. I just put in South Hill on Google Maps and look for the two identical mega trees as shown here. And you can also see this board as an indication just beside the two identical mango trees. So friends, let's start our trekking journey to Kathildar waterfall. After around 5 minutes of trekking, we can see a flat land from where we could see the Srivardhan Fort and Manoranjan Fort of Rajmachi Fort. It will take picture also. We would have to tell that before and after. <laughs> after crossing a small river at the flat flat view after which the trail descends to the dense forest. There are tapes, ribbons tied to the trees to guide you to the correct path. Mostly there are few trekkers or none in the way so it's quite probably that you might lose your way if you anytime feel lost you can always trace back to the lost tape or ribbon also there are crayons or arrows marked to further assist you as we all know Lonola is a very popular weekend gateway near Pune and Mumbai in the monsoon season the entire region near Lonola turns emerald green and is home to numerous waterfalls and to witness its beauty and lacks of tourists make way to the town. If you are someone who wants to ditch the conventional spots and avoid the crowd for adventure and peace, one such place is this Kathaldar waterfall. Kathaldar is a seasonal waterfall located in the Hulhaus valley on the same trek route which further goes towards a popular Rajmachi fort. The waterfall is inaccessible by the road and one has to trek through the dense forest to make it to the waterfall. You can refer this map if you want to reach Kathildar waterfall from Della Adventurous Park, Lonavla. Since it's a seasonal waterfall and depends completely on rains for its sources. So the best time to visit the waterfall is the monsoon month starting from July to mid-September. For the rest of the year, if you want to experience a jungle trek, Kathalda trek could be a great option but don't expect a waterfall in the other seasons. I would rate Kathalda waterfall trek as a moderate to difficult trek in terms of difficulty. The trek is not tough in terms of steepiness, neither in terms of fitness required. It's just the confusing roots in the dense jungle which makes us call it difficult. The forest is so thick that at places the sunlight doesn't even reach the ground. So the darkness and the dampness of the forest, the confusing trials, and the chances of getting lost of what all makes it a moderate to difficult trek. Somewhere in the middle of the trek, there is a fallen tree. So you will know you are on the right track if you visit anytime soon. The jungle is so dense that even in the afternoon it looks very dark. I absolutely loved every bit of this jungle track. The track is mostly a continuous descent with a path of ascent near the end from where you can get the view of the waterfall. Huh? 
So guys, we are finally able to see the waterfall and there are two streams of waterfall separated by around some kind of 5 meters. It's getting very tempting to reach the base of the waterfall to have all of it, but it's not advisable especially in the peaks of the monsoon where the water flow is unexpected and can get scary anytime. Also, the boulders which lead you to the base of the waterfall are very slippery. So please watch out your steps and carefully check down. And this is the Sri Vardhan photo of Rajamachi Fort which you can see from the waterfall base. And this is a beautiful view of Kazaldar waterfall on the route which further goes towards a popular Rajmachi fort. It's the time to wrap up guys. If you really like this video, please like, share and comment your feedback. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to the Treknosh channel.